You might think time travel is just science fiction, but as far as the laws of physics go, it's totally possible. Possible, however, does not mean easy. It may take a few thousand years to sort out the details, but in theory, at least, we already know how to build a time machine. Einstein's theory of general relativity says that time moves more slowly in stronger gravity. So if you could somehow link two regions of space where gravity is different, you could travel back and forth between them to move forward or backward through time. Nowhere is gravity stronger than in the vicinity of a black hole. So if you could hang out near a black hole, time for you would move more slowly than on Earth. Which means in the time it takes you to have a cup of coffee, empires could rise and fall at home. But for this to work, you need to somehow get from Earth to the black hole instantaneously. Recent news notwithstanding, nothing can travel faster than light, but there may be a way around that. General relativity allows the existence of shortcuts through space-time, called wormholes, which could allow travel to the future and the past. Say you set up a wormhole so that both ends start in 2011. After a year on Earth, only a few minutes will have passed near the black hole. If you then drag the slower end back to Earth, time will flow at the normal rate, but will be offset by a year. So you could go back in time, but only as far back as when the time machine was first built. Of course, it's not like you can just make a wormhole wherever you want. You have to start with an existing one. The good news is that wormholes may be popping into and out of existence at the subatomic scale all the time. They don't last very long though. You need some way to prop them open. And for that, you need something with negative gravity. As far as we know, gravity caused by normal matter is always attractive. But the universe may be full of stuff that works opposite to normal matter, namely dark energy the energy that drives the ongoing expansion of the universe. So yeah, just find a black hole, a wormhole that connects to it, and prop open the tunnel so you can travel back and forth through time and space. Needless to say, all this cosmic engineering doesn't come cheap. Propping open a wormhole wide enough for a human to pass through would take the energy output of thousands of stars. That's a bit much for any immediately foreseeable human civilization, but that's not really the point. In theory, at least, it's possible. This of course raises all sorts of questions, like the grandfather paradox. Say you build a time machine and it lasts for generations, and one of your grandchildren comes back and kills you. How would that work? If you were killed before your grandson's father, your son, was conceived, then how could he be around to come back and kill you? Some physicists think the many worlds interpretation of quantum mechanics might resolve the issue. Perhaps it's not your actual grandson that comes back, but rather someone from a slightly different universe. Problem solved. Others say that there may be some undiscovered law of physics that bars certain kinds of time travel. Whatever the case, as it stands now, while time travel may be physically possible, it's definitely unfeasible. But give it a few thousand years. We can't know what the future holds, at least for now. Mm -hmm.